Welcome back to the Emerald Run. Well, not really a run, but, you know. Okay, so, I just said I was going to get this rare candy here, and so I pretty much just got two rare candies in the last two minutes. And Zigzagoon's holding something good. Boy, this thing is the most useful level three ever, and he still has one more use. Like, Zigzagoon has three uses. Uh, use number one, he can pick up stuff. Not really good stuff, but hey, you take what, uh, what comes for you. Um, the next thing is, he's a good, uh, HM slave. Anything that you don't want to waste on your actual good Pokemon, you use with him. And then finally, Zigzagoon does well as, uh, as a battle decoy. Like, if your best Pokemon faints and you have a revive on you, and you want to use... Okay, good, I have two spaces. Best Pokemon faints, and you have a revive, and you want to use the revive, then just send Zigzagoon out, and then use the revive, and uh, Zigzagoon will... Oh, darn it! I, I can't believe I forgot to do this. Crap, crap, crap in a barrel. Alright, I gotta go back. I'm terribly sorry. I forgot to get the stupid uh, uh, plant thing from Devon Company, so now I gotta use my repels. Okay, super repel. Thankfully, since I have this in fast mode, this should only take about a minute to do. Well, as long as I'm here, I guess this works out okay, because now I got Gargivire holding the amulet coin. I really didn't think I'd see these rich people again, but um, you know what? I got an amulet coin. I'm going to put it to use. Yeah, your little Lotad and your Zigzagoon aren't going to last very long. Leaf Blade. And hey, Grovile's moving first again. Very nice. Zigzagoon. Oh, I attacked the same one. Yeah, now you can't do that. Like, this is the last game with the double battles where they just send out the next one immediately. And it goes down before it can even fight. Oops. Oh. Alright, well, you gotta use Confusion. You have no choice. And... Alright, so how are we doing on time? Two minutes. Alright, how much money did we get from this? Oh, baby, say it ain't so. 6,400. That's very good. And I found a potion that I'm not gonna need. Did my Pokemon take any damage? No? Great. I have to hold on to this for a while. Okay, so Super Repel is still in effect, so I gotta come back here, and now, oop, okay, Repel wore off. Okay, so now I'm going to, I'm gonna save, because, or, state one, because the Pokemon, the fossilized Pokemon Lil Leap that I get back, this is one of those times where, um, you can kind of choose the nature that you want it to have. Like, normally, you have to keep running around in the wild if you want to get a Pokemon uh, with the right nature. But for this, I mean, you could just walk up to this guy and talk to him. And, oop, a lax nature. That's not good. And he'll just keep on uh, giving it back to you. And he'll, it'll be a different nature each time. So, it's the same thing with Metagross. Like, um, in this game, darn it, Bashful, it's a neutral nature. If you... If you happen to be a person who likes training Metagross, then you'll definitely, when you get the the young form, the basic form of it, and I forget what it's called at the moment, uh, but make sure that you save before you pick it up, and you'll want a Metagross that either has an adamant nature or a brave nature, because uh, both of them raise attack, but then one decreases special attack and one decreases speed. Now, you might have... Oops, modest nature, not good. I'm I'm looking for a defensive one here. You might have a different strategy for your Metagross. I don't know. But I like to get a Metagross that has um, a high attack power somehow. And something that doesn't really hurt it otherwise. Relax Nature. That's good. Here's what Relax does. It lowers speed, which pretty much sucks with him anyway. And it increases defense. And as you can see, special defense and defense are just about even. So, and Zigzagoon's holding something. X attack. Okay, I could just sell those. So anyway, I guess it wasn't a total waste. I mean, I did get to uh, buy that stuff. And this Pokemon, I might as well check it out. How may I help you? Timer balls. These will come in handy later on. I'm going to buy, I don't know, I guess about 
Do I really want 21? Eh, I'll buy 14 of them. These will come in handy later on against, like, Rayquaza or something. An escape rope. We'll get them up to four here. And does this thing have... No, darn it. Just get a couple of repeat balls here. I thought this place would have revives, but it doesn't. Nope, no revives. And I'm going to sell my useless stuff. This is another time to do some backpack maintenance. Okay, sell the exit attack. And, oops, no, I thought that was a potion for a second, not protein. Don't want to sell that. And the super potion, I really ought to get rid of it soon. But for now, we got to get back on track to where we were. So Pokemon, I mean, uh, there's that repel. Three repels. I only thought I thought I only had one. Okay. Well, it's gonna go out in just a second here. So, boy, it held out exactly long enough. I mean, good job, Rafael. So anyway, back to what we were doing. It actually took four minutes to do that, but eh. Well, I got to walk around more. Ninkata. Okay. Okay, Ninkata. As Slack off is at the exact right level to be pulling. Pulling back. That was actually really lucky. So if I want slack, if you ever want to see your slack off again, you will give me 1300 yen. No, I won't take it back. All right. So by level, your Nintakata has grown by 10. Uh, we can raise one more of your Pokemon. So which should we raise? For... Uh, okay. So it's time to put Trap Inch in here. See what happened is I'm using this daycare center to the fullest extent it's capable of. Okay. Switch out. Let's see the summary on you. Oh, good, you're about to level up. Very nice. Um, I take out the two Pokemon that are ready to evolve, and then I put in two more that I'm just going to leave them in there for the whole rest of the game, basically, until right at the end. And you'll see why later, but for now, let's see, can Slackoth hold his own in battle? I mean, I know he lo loafs around, he has that Truant ability, but... Now, this Doduo isn't exactly a very tough Pokemon, so we'll see if he can handle himself. No, I guess not. I better I better not risk it. See, you'll summon Gargifier who has an amulet coin. Otherwise, I wouldn't do it. Confusion. Whoops. Okay. I see what I did wrong. All right, so I got to... Take this off of Grovile. Grovile's almost there, but Slackoth is closer, so... Slackoth, just for a moment, he gets the experience share. And we'll switch out with Garjofire. And I never got these berries. Weepair. I'm not sure what they do. Like, I mean, I'll know immediately as soon as I check them out, but I don't know them off the top of my head. I'm better off with Pokemon Natures, because... Oops. Because Pokemon natures are more relevant to me. Like berries, yeah, it could be some little hobby if you want it to be. But for now, I just like prefer Pokemon natures. Anyway, you might have noticed Santa Claus is standing out there. Promoting atheism. Hey, Santa. Oh, Veltor, you look like you have a lot of zip. Oh, fine, I've decided. I need a favor. Mallville City has an underground uh, sector called New Mallville. Uh, Veltor, I'd like you to go switch off the generator. It's been running a bit haywire. It's getting unsafe. So here, um, you little kids uh, should go down to the unsafe haywire generator and uh, hopefully it won't explode on you or anything. Don't worry, it won't be a challenge for you. Uh, surf away. That's it. You have my trust. Okay, so he just gave me this key. Now, let's see. I do want to, before I go to New Mauville, I do want to get the, um, wait, I can't think of what it's called. My Ninkata. I want to get Ninkata out of there, so I guess what I'll do is I'll do a little bit of training here. But not on Oddish, because he gives you special attack level ups. There we go. And Gargivire is out, and I forgot about that, so let's switch out. <sighs> Alright dudes, I'm out of time again, so what I'll do is, whenever I come back, you'll see that... Um, Let's see, that Slackoth is just about ready to level up. It's 343 points away, so we're just about there. So until next time, dudes, take care. This has been uh, the next part, I think part 20, of my Let's Play of Pokemon Emerald version.